During an interview in 2007, J.K. Rowling, the author of the Harry Potter series, admitted that she drew parallels to Nazi Germany during the Second World War. She stated that her decision was conscious, there were parallels in the ideology. She wanted Harry to leave our world and find exactly the same problems in the wizarding world. So you have the intent to impose a hierarchy, you have bigotry and this notion of purity. But how did she draw these parallels? During the Holocaust of World War II, many people believed that ethnic cleansing was a necessary procedure that would ultimately benefit society. These ideas of ethnic cleansing and hatred are identical to those expressed through the villains of Rowling's Harry Potter series. Filthy little mudblood! In the magical world, wizards who had blood that had been tainted by a muggle were condemned to die by prejudiced wizards. Hitler had the Nazis, while Voldemort had the Death Eaters, both groups striking fear to their enemies. The denial by the Minister of Magic Cornelius Fudge that Voldemort had arisen echoes the government of Neville Chamberlain when he minimised the menace of the Nazi regime for political convenience. The Snatchers were formed by Lord Voldemort when he took control of the Ministry of Magic. They were an informal group to catch Muggleborns and Half-Bloods. The counterpart of the Snatchers to Hitler's regime is the Gestapo, Hitler's secret police who rounds up the Jews. They both act in secrecy, spreading their fear that they would strike at random. They even kidnap, murder and terrorise those who speak out against them. <laughs> when Voldemort took control of the Ministry, they created the Muggleborn Registration Commission to interrogate witches and wizards about their blood type. Would you please tell the court from which witch or wizard you took this one? I didn't take it. You're lying. Wands only choose witches and you are not a witch. But I am. Tell them, Rich. Tell them what I am. There were several attempts to stop genocide from not only within Germany, but from the countries all around the world, such as the French resistance, who opposed the Nazis in their attempt at ethnic cleansing. J.K. Rowling creates the Order of the Phoenix, Dumbledore's army, the Quibbler and Potter Watch to show the presence of the resistance against the Death Eaters. <laughs> These are all clear comparisons between the elements of the Harry Potter narrative and World War II Nazi Germany. It's easy to see that the events that had happened in the past had influenced J.K. Rowling's characters within the series. <laughs>